Speaking at the occasion, the Executive Director of National Elections Watch, Marcella Sambasese, stated that the days of campaigning on irrelevance are past, replaced by a concise, knowledgeable and policy-based electioneering process. Those are the days when elections were only about lying, dancing and thinking democracy. Today we are thinking democracy. Police media superintendent Ibrahim Samura stated that it is the duty of the police force to engage in responsible policing devoid of bias and violence, regardless of personal convictions. Which is why he went on to state that of the 56 persons arrested on various charges of violence and riotous conduct during the election hearing process, 52 have pled guilty. As elections were closing, it is incumbent on the SFP to engage the citizens of this country on the need for all of us to be violence free, to be rich from violence and acrimony. And we must each other irrespective of our political differences. So we don't need to be any of the political parties in this country. We've been going out and engaging the civil community, sensitizing them against violence, sensitizing them against drug abuse, sensitizing them against vandalism, terrorism, and other ills to society. But in as much as we are charged with the duty of announcing an atmosphere, a very conducive atmosphere, but the peaceful conduct of the elections lost as to be done by the people of Sierra Leone. Just recently, 56 people were arrested by the police. Most of them are made up of the girls, blacks, and kids. All of them have been charged to court. And out of 15 of them, he had guilty. For the offense, offenses of righteous conduct, disorderly behavior, murder, wounding indifference. And so on and so forth. If you have manifestations that are going to leave no pain at all to ensure that the mass shooting elections are conducted in a rather confusing atmosphere. The executive director of Campaign for Good Governance, Valnora Edwin, stated that the consortium and partners have arranged a week-long activities starting with a launch at the Mabela community in the east of Freetown, followed by other processes strewn across the country. The week of citizens' engagement is designed to increase public awareness and voter education around the power of the votes with the theme index power. My serial, my responsibility. There will be a range of activities starting with a launch at the Mabela community in the east of the Vita, which we've already done. And this will be followed by an elections bazaar featuring the various electoral management bodies and stakeholders at the National Stadium, 12th and 13th February, at the Apoop School Grounds in the east of Vita, 14th and 15th February, and Tumbo Park, 16th and 17th. There will be community voter education and mobilization events and institutional outreach campaigns across the country. The election battle will be in Freetown, in Bo, Panama and McKinney, with booths erected by National Electoral Commission, the Political Party Registration Commission, the National Commission for Democracy and the Serbian Police. Sarah Kale reporting for Star.